So my name is Rafael Nunez. I'm an 18, and I am writing a thesis in the Spanish department on um, the resurgence of tango as a socio-political movement in Buenos Aires towards the 21st century. As we think of tango, it's usually like this exotic representation or stereotype representation of, of two dancers, one holding the rose in the mouth. That's like a cultural good that we buy, we go see, but for the people of Buenos Aires, it's part of them, it's part of their history. Tango was created at the same time as their society was created. There was an economic crisis that was of the sort that had never happened before in the country, and everyone came together spontaneously in the heat of the moment to kind of just kick out the oligarchs, the government that didn't care for their interests. In 2001, there was a group of musicians that began to take this political stance into the music. They began to think, well, how do we take back our country? We're gonna go to tango, but we're gonna make it our own. We're going to politicize it and use it as a form of resistance, as a form of rebellion to the government to show that this is ours and they can't take our identity from us. At this latter part of my research, I'm just studying that movement, how they express themselves, the different way that this is represented in the music, the dance, the poetry, and how politics and culture and economics are inextricably linked for these people in this expression called tango.